Hey folks, this is Noble Rambler and welcome back to RimWorld where we've got some serious planting going on here. We've got most everybody assigned to planting except for two or three that are still out hunting. As, you know, we do need meat as well, but let's get as much of this planted as soon as possible. We're at the beginning of summer, so third day in and need to get at least two full crops in if it's still possible before the middle of, of, uh, of autumn. Thomas loves out over here planting. Rabbit was down in here last I saw. Rabbit. Okay, where'd you go? Right over there working your way back over to help them out. Okay. Then down in here, David was... What? Oh, he just fully healed from his uh, his injuries. Bopping the uh, wild boar on the head. And we didn't appreciate it. <laughs> so they got a lot of points fast from meleeing animals. 200 points per wallop kind of a kind of a thing so what did i set him to do anyway hauling granite to wall i don't remember now i said this before i i saved it last night and turned it off um you are working all the way up into oh i asked you to come over and start filling this in okay that's right okay so planting who's not planting here sangria is oh Tony suggested that we maybe grab a breeding pair of turkeys and start growing a flock of turkeys that we can go ahead and, and butcher and get a homegrown source of meat. And I thought that might be a pretty good idea. The question is whether or not they eat kibble fast enough to offset the uh, the meat that we're going to get out of them. So that's the, the, the unknown for me right there. But I set a hen over there and over on this side. Somewhere up in here, there is a hen and a rooster that are all just two and three years old. So we'll see if she can pull those off. Kathra has been planting, and again, she gets the big bonus. Uh, so to plant 20 times gets 20 points right there. Because she has a green thumb trait. So that's a big bonus there. Natalia is sleeping. Michael, you are relaxing socially. You were still down here filling up the... Uh, the blocks for us because we really need that for construction and your mood's been doing pretty good lately yeah so low on food and, and joy and you're still way up there so doing pretty good right now alicia has been planting we're gonna get looks like most of this done i threw some more field in here for corn uh we got all of this in here uh added a little more hay grass in this area and they've been even out and over here just just filling it all in added a little more of this back so, in fact, let's toss that in there, grow into that space. Yeah, I think we're going to be okay. We're going to go through the hay really fast right now, but we do have quite a bit that's getting close. There's, now that's only 40%. What else do we have up in here? You are 39%. Okay, down in here, you are 37 Yeah, it may be close. It just might be. Just might be running out of hay right about the time that, uh, you know, they may be just on the verge of starving about the time that the hay comes in. Let's put it that way. Anyway, um, Grandma, where are you? You were set mostly to work on the, uh, on your, your sculptures. In fact, did you finish one? Looks like you're bringing more wood over. Let's see here. What we got in here? You, made by Cathra, normal. What was with that one? Um, this work bears representation of a cattle in the top hat of a professor. Okay, that's all it says. All right. Um, you're not an art. You made my grandma. Okay, what is this one? It's an awful art. <laughs> and there's no description. Oh, man. So, yeah, RimWorld is got a little bit of a bug right there i'm not sure it'll be worked out for the the 1.0 update but that's just something we've got to live with with this version so that was that was practice that's all that was but that is keeping her needs her mood up and that's really what it's taking right now to do that to come up with something else there's tons of joy because um i've been enjoying myself so much so i guess tons of joy maybe comes what, what triggers that is that something that when they're doing something they really like for a certain number of, of ticks, then it triggers that? I'm not sure. 
What else we have there? Needs. Extremely comfortable. Where are we at right now? Right there. So it must be a really good chair. A superior wooden dining chair. Good. And what else? Moderate expectations, spacious interior, eight a fine meal, and slightly impressive bedroom, which will hold for another seven hours. Okay, well, we're we are well we're at sleep time, so I guess we spent the whole day just working on this. Okay. So David dropped off marble there and and marble over here. It's interesting. It's, I've seen that before. I told him to go here, there, 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 and end here. I don't know how many times I've seen where it does the first one, skips everything in the middle, goes to the last one. And that's it. He'll probably have nothing queued up now. Yep. Well, resting cleared it, but still, it took out, it got rid of all the cues. Interesting how it does that. I don't, I don't quite understand the mechanic behind that. We'll have to get somebody else to bring more of that out. Anyway, Eric has been butchering all day long, and it's been a priority. I didn't realize I did that. Are you dying over here? You're dying over here. Go get a meal. Someone else can work on that turtle. Probably Natalia. She she might do that through the night. I don't know. You are consuming a fine meal. What were you doing over here? Who knows? Anybody else outside? Any hunters? Nope. Nope. I'm going to break this, probably Eric. Yep. So he'll get that meal in him, and that should, uh, should should clear that up. Where'd he go? And he is off to bed. Needs there. I think that's his line, so he's going to be fine. He'll get through the night just fine. And his comfort just went up. The beauty went up some. And Russ is going to go up. Okay, so he should be okay. Um, so, sewing... Looking fine over here. The majority of this is done too. I still took it out, even though I had it. I thought I had it uh, uncover, unchecked. I noticed when Alicia took out that tree that was sitting right there. It's almost like if there's two spaces, you know, a tree is two spaces high, that one and, and right up above. Like it casts a shadow, so they get rid of it. So unless I take out two spaces of a growing area, they'll still come and, and take it down. Natalia is going hunting, which probably, unfortunately, doesn't work because she's shooting in the dark, and so the, the percentages are so low. I think I'll go ahead and take her off of that. As much as I want to get her skilled up, it's not going to work out with this schedule. Where are you at? That's right, everything here is mixed up. I have no idea where anybody is. Natalia is at the bottom now. So hunt, take that back down. Let's move you back into... Somehow you got, oh, that's not, that's Taylor. Okay, that's right. So let's go ahead and reset you. Go ahead and do that one. And then you can move on to the uh, uh, the assault rifle, hopefully. Okay. So do I have anything on my list? Actually, I do. I started talking last time about Klaus and Alicia being in this area just because they've got higher melee skills, which eventually will be Eric and David, if we go the melee route with him, that's that's if he's the way he was a one and a one, so it could go either direction really. Um, I think there was one more. Well, some of them came with with melee skills. They were up there, right there is an eight, and Alicia came in with an eight, and Grandma came in with a nine. So I'm thinking this whole block here and maybe into here should concentrate on melee skills. So we can head right up the hallway here and go thump thump on prisoners. So I think that's what's going to determine what happens right in here. So I need to set up another uh, singles block right in here. And if one of them do marry off, they can have the first bedroom on this side and kind of be in that direction. I think that is one of the factors as to who lives where as far as bedrooms go. So that's going to help out. Otherwise, cooks in this area would would be good um yeah we'll come up with more reasons later but that's probably what's going on there um let's think about orders while it's nighttime klaus is attempting to recruit purple why you're up it's three in the morning okay <laughs> i guess he got an early start to, to bedtime let's see if we can get purple to join us this time otherwise um like we'll 
kind of show that there on the side. Let's get into work orders. So we've got most of the planting done. So let's move folks back out of growing. So rabbit stays, sangria stays, Anastasia has given birth. All right, we'll come right back to this. And there's Yummy. Who else? Just Yummy. And I'm sure, I'm hearing shooting. Hmm. Well, let's look at Yummy. Then we'll look at the shooting. Then we'll get back to whatever it was I was doing. Animals. We're over here. And Matador. Where's Matador? Okay. Matador must have come out of someone else when I wasn't paying attention. Animals must have um grazing grazing gets us into kibble but with the dogs i'm just keeping them in the dog zone so they also have access to the kitchen and that's fine so i'm keeping them in there anybody else that doesn't belong in here so grazing here for a hare and then you five are in the wild boar zone whereas the rest of them are in the grazing area so they can be trained a little bit easier okay so nothing else there's no sangrias written in here and that's all the way it's supposed to be okay so there's that one and then what else was i do oh hunting who's out here hunting in the dark miss a p you're trying to hit over here and your chances are 1.1 yep that's i'm I'm convinced that dark still has something to do with this. It doesn't list it. That doesn't mean it's not happening in the background. That's There's just no reason for it to be that low. Just, yeah. Anyway, Miss B, you also can come off of hunting. It's not going to work for you either. And I really would like to see the, uh, the mining accomplish. Your needs are fine. Let's send you back down. In fact, while you're here, um, why don't you haul in... A load of steel on your way in. Okay. And then... Hunt... I mean, uh, mine where? Do we get back into mining out the steel? Do we get into building our little booming up barn area? Do we get into this load of steel? Hmm... Let's get this situated oops didn't mean to do that pause try that again must be go back over here right there then we're gonna shift and click this one where am i right in here after that well you're gonna haul it down to probably here actually to here so tell you what you'll already be in this area come on over here and pop this one after that and then that one and we'll get enough of this done so I can set the uh, the door in there so it's all ready to be built and seal this off from whatever's going on. And I went ahead and moved this one over. It was sitting right here to match all the rest of them, but eventually I can imagine we're, we're going to be punching into this. In fact, I probably should put another one. Well, I can't. The doorway's there. Hmm. Maybe another one right here, just in case we punch into something we don't want to. Yeah, we'll see. Anyway, um... So you're on the way in. I'm hearing pounding. There's that. It was more of a, a tap tap, like a. What was I hearing? Oh, I bet you it was a. No, it wasn't a statue being made. Bowler hat. I decided to pop in a bowler hat, not assign it to anybody, and just see who picks it up. Just see whose personality that fits. Otherwise, looking at weapons in here. We out of racks. We're out of racks. Okay. Got to come up with a better plan for this. This is still kind of just thrown together after we pulled the uh, uh, these guys out. The mortars. So I haven't gone back to really rethink that yet. Anyway, that's what I was doing. Let's pause. Work schedule and no more distractions. Let's work through this. Okay. So Sangria is going to remain on growing because she's good at it. And Cathra is for sure. Klaus is not. So right now, he's wardening. Then he drops into Cook. I think we need to drop him, drop him into construction. Okay. Handy, of course, is construction. So we're going to do that. Do we have to, though? No, because she'll go into crafting for uh, next if we don't. Okay. And then... Well, I'll tell you, that can go away, and that can go away. And then she will automatically drop into there and then move her way through anyway. 
that's fine. That works for her. Cathra is growing first. Actually, is wardening first, then growing, then art. Okay, that works. Over here, Tomislav is researching first. Yeah, I think we'll get back to getting the research done, which will get us into um, mining and and you know deep deep mining soon. So we'll, we'll get to, we'll go that direction. Cooking over here, and everything else is fine. Alicia, get you back into mining, and just wondering who we want to do some backup cooking though. Got to think about that. Let's go through that next. But get you back to mining for now. Cleaning as a backup. Um, Miss a P, mining. Cleaning is a backup, and yeah, I guess so. We never get to that backup anyway. So this hasn't been a, a time in a very long time when there hasn't been some mining to do. Uh, Grandma is right now arting until we can come up with a, a grand scheme for her, a, a master plan, whether that's cooking or what that's going to be. Um, Michael crafting just because... <laughs> we need the blocks and he can handle it and Catherine now is is gardening um, Eric has been constructing but he I guess I reset that afterward because he was cooking he was butchering and that should be fine meals we're at 60 meals now so Chantico can do some butchering okay um, David construction also as well as Warden that works. And Natalia is first thing tailoring, which is now done. So now she'll fall back into cooking. So she's going to do some butchering, possibly. Do I want that to happen? And then back to hunting again. Let's get the smithing going. Let's make her build us some more assault rifles. I think that would be wise. Medicines, we're at 35. So we need to get back into that soon too. Might just just have to manually assign somebody to do that for a while, just to just to get it done. Anyway, um, let's let them go. Run this way. Consuming a fine meal. Handy is sowing a daylily because she was on. There we go. She was on growing, and now she is on construction. So she's gonna pop out this dresser for for Michael. Let's see what she makes here. And up. Whoa! Handy made a poor dresser. I didn't think that was possible. So let's uninstall that one. You know, get back here and complete your uh, your disaster here. And let's dresser and build a new one. Let's try that again. Thank you. Otherwise, um, I'll pause because I want to kind of program Handy to get a whole bunch of stuff done today. As, you know, we might have one more episode before the next raid. We'll see. So I want to take as much advantage of this as I can. Um, let's see. You're going to build that. Your food was oh, another few hours. So what can you do in a few hours? This is Miss P, and she's going to be going to bed before too long. So come right back after you build that and smooth this area out. You can do it so much quicker than most. Take on this much right here. Okay, so Rabbit is going to be sewing. What is this now? Wooden dresser down there. Uh, what was he doing? He was sewing that right there. Okay, so this one have its materials? It does not. And that one does not. Okay, well, we'll see where, where Handy ends up. Anyway, Rabbit, um, Chantigo... You are praying, getting your joy up, and your project for the day is 11 corn down there, and the corn's run out. Otherwise, I'm seeing 25 squirrel meat. Can you haul that? You can. It worked this time. So 25 squirrel. I don't have any more corn to fill in there. So that's as far as you're going to get. Plus this one, 22 of 50. So Shantigo, then you're going to fill up your stove. And you'll be good for the day. Thankfully, the wood's nearby. So that, that helps out. Otherwise, who's left? Klaus, you building a wooden shelf. Let's get you to to uh, smooth out a bunch more of this room, too. So, Klaus, you're going to take this run right here. And one more. 
Okay, Sangria, still sleeping. Cathra, uh, just waking up, it looks like. Uh, Natalia, you are disassembling mechanoids. Oh, okay, good. That's the first job on the, uh, on the on the machining bench there. Michael is making stone blocks. Good. Miss P is bringing in her compacted steel, and she's going to start mining. Alicia is still on planting for what? One more uh, work. Alicia, one more run on... No, you're still... Sangria. It reordered. Uh, okay, you are on mining again. What to do with you? Alicia needs... You're just starting your day, and you're in great shape. Joy's kind of low, which means you're going to trigger at 10 o'clock to go and do something. So you're up here right now. Let's send you into here and get this started. That'll be fine. Eric's sleeping, and his food is decent enough where he can actually get up right now and finish this last row over here. So the Mississippi can go to bed and nobody will disturb her by the time they get finished. All right, her room's done. Next, we need to get into this one. And then this bedroom block is pretty much finished. And we need to get these, these turrets going to protect those that live here. David, you are building marble tile. Um, just kind of getting started on your day. Got a meal. Yeah, I'd say just go through this place and see what you can do. I'm not going to assign you. That way, you're free to get purple some food soon. When they're assigned, they, they probably won't break away to do that. Grandma, you are consuming a fine meal. Let's think about this. What do we do with her? So, character likes animals, just not very good at it. Now, well, five is decent. Get you outside. Hmm. There aren't many things. Only some turkeys to tame. Everything else is ours, so there's no negative effect if you do it wrong. So there's that to think about. Cooking. Cooking. Let's start with that. How about you do some butchering? Let's try that. Where are you? Right there. Let's set you to butchering. Right there. Go make kibble for a while. Let's see how your mood does with that. Um, what's your mood right now? You're in pretty good shape. Tons of joy. And you do like the cooking, so maybe we can maintain the tons of joy with that. Extremely comfortable. Didn't. It's probably not going to last long. Um, what's this chair like? This chair is superior, so we get the comfortable again. We're just really ugly. Um, when you're done working on that, I'm going to assign you to cleaning. Cleaning blood of rat. And... Where's more? Blood of turkey, mega sloth, squirrel, and rat times four. Oh, that was a big pile right there. <laughs> so let's see what happens in this area today. Otherwise, how's Mr. P's room coming? We're in here just working away at it. Eric should be showing up soon. Playing chess. And completely cancel everything that I asked him to do. Uh, huh. It's not even 10 o'clock yet. Hmm. Well... Eric, I'm going to cancel that on you. Come on over here. Well, no, I did it wrong. Come on over, Eric. There. Where are you at? Oh, interesting pathing. Okay, pop into here. Where is that pig going? Right there, picked up a... Oh, every time we build a new one of these. Yep. Copy that and paste that. I should stop you in your tracks. Yep. Why don't you go put that away, please? Thank you. Where are you going now with it? Chase you down. What is this? There's a wooden dresser. Okay. Well, there's the pig. Okay. Now what'd you build? You built a superior dresser. That's more like it. Okay. So that is Handy. Handy is now consuming a fine meal. Then Handy is going to do what? Hmm. Let's get the hospital complete. What is left? I want you to do this one, this one, and then that chair finally. It's been waiting forever. And then get into there, into there, and we'll get into there, and we'll see. And then there, there's kind of one of each different kind of, of category in there. We'll see what's left afterwards. Actually, these over here need something too. All right. Oh, I hit the control button, not the shift button. That just 
blew everything, didn't I? It did. Cancel. Go get your meal. We'll do it again. All right, can, uh, shift button this time. Isabel has given birth. Boy, we got a lot of puppies being made right now. Okay, you're going to go there. Uh, go ahead and go. Then you do that. Then you're going to do this. And one of these. One of those. And a couple of those. All right, we'll see where that all lands. So, Klaus, you are done relaxing socially. I'm going to leave you alone now. Maybe let you do some more uh, working with Purple. Purple get fed? Yes. So, David's already done that. Uh, Klaus, could you chat with if you wanted to? Nope. So, Purple has been talked to. By whom? Social. David. Purple rejected the offer. So, Klaus, David, and Kathra are Purple's new friends. Yep. Grandma, who you've been socializing with. And do we have... We have acquaintances. And we have a rival. Sangria is is Grandma's rival. Ah, that's going to be interesting. I get some uh, some friendly brawls going on there. Deep chat with, with uh, Natalia. Okay. So I'm wonder, I've never really gone back to see if anybody is related to anybody else. You guys can pause and look at the... Uh, at the the stats there if you want otherwise i'm boy a lot of rivals so eric is a rival of grandma missipede david alicia sangria natalia um what am i hearing rainy thunderstorm um i'm looking for timers these don't say that they unrival interesting okay so Arrivals permanent. Alicia, just acquaintances and friends. There's fire. Let's finish this. Friends. That's Miss P. Michael. Acquaintances and friends. And arrival and Kathra. So Michael is Kathra's rival. Ah. We have friend, acquaintances. Definition of friend over acquaintance. Probably just the number. Maybe. Uh, what, your Natalia's rival is Kathra. Kathra's kind of a rival of a lot of folks, huh? Yeah, I think all these red negatives over on the sides over here. Otherwise, she's a good friend with a few. Yep. Um, Sangria. Lover, Klaus, 20 and 55 still. Uh, friends, acquaintances, rival, and grandma. Klaus is a friend of everybody. And all greens for the most part. Because he gets along with them all. Chantigo is a rival to Kathra as well. Hmm. And there's all of Chantigo's numbers. Rabbit. Acquaintance. Gets along. Well, doesn't get along that well with Natalia, but is not a rival. Okay. And Handy. No rivalries there. Bond to Sienna. And Tomislav. Rival to Kathra as well. Okay. Where's that fire? Over here. Um, let's... Don't know if I can cancel that. I don't want to cancel that. I'll just try to stop people from going up to it. Eric, you're fine. Rain's going to put that out really quick. But when it's not raining, I would like to have that home zone so that they can put out the fires. So... Hmm... Well, let's assign you to something. Can you sow that area for me? Thank you. Sangria is not. Shantigo is. Shantigo, how about you? Reserved by Isabel. Where is Isabel? Nowhere nearby. So Shantigo, move these. And that will give you something to do. There's Bugsy. So we had another puppy. Animals. Um... Right over here. So, Killer and Maggie. There's Killer. <laughs> and animals. Ooh, what was that? A flash. This is. Oh, I see. It was this. I thought we had a big lightning strike or something. Maggie, right in there. Okay. So, animals. You guys are in the dog zone. And. Everything is set properly. Looks to be. How is Grandma doing up here? 
So, making more meat. And needs are still pretty good. Uh, joy isn't going up like I expected. Hmm. Character. Uh, cooking. Okay, well, there's a passion for it. On our way to make a large sculpture. So we are done with the uh, with the butchering. And I see we need to bring in some foods. We're doing a little bit of harvesting. Who's nearby? Kathra is planting. And there is a little bit of food to bring in right there. Who's around here? Shantigo. Over there, cleaning dirt. Okay, well, in that case, come on over and haul these berries in. Any foods up in here? Yep. Rabbit, haul in all the rice. Let's see how far you can get. Almost. So, Cathro, you were over in here. You made it to there. Um, yeah, just leave you. Hopefully, some animals will, will get to... Uh, Get the word that they need to go and deal with that. I need hunters, though. And it's raining. Another mega sloth. There's more meat. I wonder if we should go after all the boom rats right now. Kind of like that idea. <laughs> Eric and David, let's go thump on some boom rats. <laughs> the rain will put you out. Um, who to, which, let's just grab one person specifically to do that. Who would that be? Um, meals are pretty, you know, I was going to say Shantigo. Let's do that. Shantigo, let's get outside and go do something. How's your, your food? Let's grab a meal and where are you at now? Oh, I sent you to go do that. Never mind. Come in. Haul berries, please. One at a time. Shantigo doesn't get, can you haul these? There we go. Woo! That was close. Lived out in the Midwest for a year and a half, and that was life over there. Man, those thunderstorms. A shotgun going off next to you. All right, grab a meal right there, and then I'm going to just draft you and take you out there. Break, Eric. Why? Building granite wall. Uh, needs. I don't know. I don't know. Hmm. Let run for a little bit while Shantigo's eating. We just popped up into here. And we're we are out of hay. We really are. Let's cancel that one. See if that well I'll just get moved to there though. More hay over here? Well, everybody that's in here is capable of going outside. Hopefully they can eat out here. Wandering. Milk fullness. Wandering. Yeah. Um, 64%. That is the most mature, I believe. I think so. Uh, Catherine, if you're going to do this in the rain, why don't you just start hauling it in? Well, I guess the pigs are. Okay, never mind. Go ahead and sew it. Yeah, they're bringing it in. Okay. Uh, Shanti Go. Almost missed you. Draft. Your mood is fine. Let's go hunt boom rats. Come on out over here. Let's go have some fun. Break risk, Eric. Alright, what's with Eric? How do we get him through this? You're caving pretty badly there. You have a double passion for mining. Interesting, but your joy doesn't need improving that much. Hmm. Finished fire foam. Research. Let's get back into this one right here. No, let's get into deep drilling. That's what I want to get into that one. Okay. So Eric is over here. He's going to do some construction, which he likes to do. And the mood is back up again, but I would think it's going to drop as soon as he get into how ugly the environment is and stuff. We'll see. We'll have to keep an eye on them. Shantigo, you are getting there. Let's have you. Let's go a little bit further. 
uh, over this way and fire at. Got him. Okay. That one, unforbid. Come on up. And there's no more. Mr. Wolf needs your fine. So you ate something. You ate a turkey. We'll haul that one in. Thank you. So, Shantigo. Let's head this way. There's one. Head over here. Hoping that the pigs will queue up the, uh, the different animal carcasses to go and get. Alright. Try them from... Oops. From there. Alright, come on to this side. There it is. Alright, um... Nothing up in there. There were some up in here. There's one there. But what's closer? Not as many as I thought there were. Are there any close to us? No. Okay, let's go to the top. I lost you. And we're at 1900. Where are you guys at? Times two. There. And there. Not as many as I thought. I thought there were more than that. Do I try... Yeah, the Mega Sloth is slow enough. I think we'll finish it with the Mega Sloth and get that hauled in. Might get a bonus squirrel here if I plan it right. Getting dark, though. That's a problem. Come on up in here. And... Fire at. Nope, that didn't work. Fire at. Got him. Steel wear. Right on the side of the prison. Of course. Hmm. Prison storage. Oh, maybe two more prison cells. This is a, a hallway right here. So we, we've got two right here. We could open up to two more right there. That's a possibility. I have to remember that's there. But Shantigo, Eric, actually, how you doing? Break risk. Eric and David are kind of tanking right now. So let's see, Eric. Uh, yeah, that's kind of hard. Hmm. What else can I do with you? You don't like to art, so I can't fall back on that one. Um, let's do it this way. Art, nope. Mining is what you want to do the most, but it's... Hmm... Let's just have you get a meal, maybe you go to bed. Go on over here and eat a meal. Maybe that'll fix it. David, what's with you? Needs. You're right at that edge, too. Rest. Uh, in the darkness. Um, character, social, construction. Can I get you to go talk to Purple? No, nope, I can get you to clean dirt in there. And what was the reserve by? Strip Purple reserve by Klaus. Huh? Klaus is attempting to recruit. Purple is reserved, not the act of stripping purple. Okay, Shantigo, you made it to there. Let's get that mega sloth and call this one done. Um, yeah, let's see if we can make this work. Okay, come closer. Fire is over there, and that's not something that concerns us, so clear home zone. There. That's it. And, okay, that's it. Sangri's out here trying to train that guy right there, that turkey. Okay. Shantigo, you are there. Alright, he's coming to you. Shantigo's shooting skill is pretty good but I've reserved all these little guys, little prey around here for the ones that need the most training, and he's kind of right in between, and he's always cooking. In fact, I wonder if we shouldn't get somebody else cooking. Well, we will soon, as soon as we get into uh, Fire At, into the new kitchen. 
Nope, hit a turtle. Okay, let's get closer. Got to make this happen. 21 hours now. Fire out. And I just saw a rat. That's not marked. There we go. Wish there was a countdown. You know, a life bar, like you see in mini games. All right, so let's mark you for hunt, and uh, Shantigo there. And can you hunt? Yeah, hunt the mega sloth and bring it in, and we should be good. I want to make sure he does it though and doesn't break at 2200 and just go to bed. And I don't notice it until he's, you know, just crossing the river down there. What's your shooting skill now? Fire. Uh, nine, so you're getting close to that ten mark. Um, Sangria, since you're here, go ahead and do that just so that nobody else gets the order to. Alright. Shantigo's up there. And a rabbit. Chose a really bad place to go lay down. <laughs> okay, that is done. And we have got some mega soft meat for tomorrow. Good. Otherwise, what did get done down here today? We tell. We've got a new bedroom for the most part done. Handy, you in bed already? You are. Okay. Klaus is in bed. And all of our builders are in bed. Okay. Uh, no more uh, bad moods going on. Good. That's right. I asked you to come in and get these done. So what's this right here? Steel isn't brought there. Steel isn't brought there. We're going to cancel all of these. You copy there and there. Let's use that steel for something else. We got everything built in there like I wanted. This is... These were already done, but these weren't. There's a poor and there's a superior. So the poor is going to uh, re or uninstall. And anybody still up that I can have do that? Miss a P. Shantigo's on his way in. And that is it. Mr. P is over here right now. Eventually, yes, but not critical right now. Let's get you... Needs, you're in good shape. Let's get you back down. Never made it down here. Let's try this one more time. Um, tell you what, let's do this. And then have you do this. And you'll break from those, but you should be able to make it to... Raid. Oh... <sighs> Attack it immediately. Of course. Jump to... Mm. Everyone just went to bed. They're tired. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Melee characters. This is the, uh, the melee gang. You are nine. They're all melee. Ooh. Every single one of them are. Interesting. What do we do with that? Let's think about that. They can't shoot back. So if we can just keep them shooting each other, we can fill every door here and just start shooting at them. Don't have to worry about getting out until they actually walk up to you. Interesting. Um, we could try and lob a mortar at them, but odds aren't that good. <laughs> um... Yeah, um, David needs, David was having trouble. I really don't want to disturb him yet. He could fire some mortars, though, but I'm too worried about that. I want to see a full night's rest on him. Klaus, you're in better shape, and you've got a great shot. So I don't want to lose you to a mortar cannon. Okay, how do we do this? Grandma, how's your mood? You're in great shape. Um... You're, you actually had a, well, you're four at shooting, so you need to get some practice going. You're good at melee, though. Let's get you on a mortar cannon. And in particular, shells, you are incendiary, and you are marked for high explosive. What is in you right now? Um, anyway, not loaded. Okay, let's try one time. 
Grandma, man that one. Okay. Let's see. Who else? And when do we need to do it? Shantigo's just getting in. He's done. He's exhausted. They're going to be a while before they get here. But I want somebody waiting for them when it happens. How fast can Klaus get from here to there? Versus them walking from there to there. It's actually fairly even. Let's let them get to in here. We're at zero hundred hours. Maybe that'll be one a.m. That would be nice. Then we'll start waking people up. If we can just get to the one a.m. mark. Boom. And this mortar. Right there. Aim at. Set force target. Hold fire. I wonder if there's any sense of her knowing where to aim to begin with. Probably not. So... Let's just get it loaded. About that time I'll get Klaus out. Okay. I have a countdown starting. Right there. Klaus, come on up. Needs. Good. You don't need any food. Work your way into... Boy, we're in the dark. We got chunks. Work your way into there. I'll give you the most time to shoot as many as possible down the length. Shantigo, how bad off are you truly? Your rest is there. Your mood is aiming for there. I gotta leave you alone. Okay. Handy, you're in better shape. You've got a sniper. Draft, let's get you straight into here. Oh, right there. Okay, you'll both do that. How do you get here? I wonder if I should pop you out this door and let you snipe at them. Interesting. Who else can I have snipe at them? Sangria. You're right there. Do you have a meal on you? You do. Draft. Consume this meal. And then... Pistol. Then, equip this one, and go here. We'll play with that. If we can get them all to head down here after her, pull her in, then they all have to go back around. That's going to give us a little more time to sleep before uh, before we've got to get everybody out there. Um, so, Tomislav needs... You're actually pretty decent. you got a sniper, too. Uh, where are all of the assaults? Nothing in there. Any more shelving units build? The dogs have preloaded for me. Don't think so. Nothing in here did that. That didn't do that. Okay. So, they're not in here. So let's see what's over in here. See what I can see in the dark. Sniper, sniper. No... No, not there, and not there. Okay, down in here. Charge, revolver, sniper. Okay, what you've got, you've got then. So, Tomislav, what to do with you? Hmm, I think what I'd do with you is get, get a charge rifle on you. Where did I see that? Right there. Go ahead and load up that one. Actually, draft. Equip that one. And then drop into here. Okay. So, Rabbit, you've got another sniper rifle. Rest is there. Mood is decent. You can do this. Okay. So, what else do we have? Even a revolver will work for you. Yeah. We saw a good revolver. Very well, we saw a revolver right there. Equip. Yeah, so draft. And come on over here and equip this. And then drop you into here. Klaus, Sangria's busy. Kathra. Good mood. <clears throat> Shooting skill now of five. Let's think about that. They're going to work through here. They're going to drop through this. They're going to come down this way or that way. 
Let's get you out here with Sangria. Right there. The two of you can can whistle at them and, and uh, lure them off to the side. Natalia, you're already up. You got a shooting skill of six. You're in great shape over here. You're hired. Come on up here. What can we do with you? You can take the other door. Hop into there. And... Michael needs... Decent on mood. There's an assault rifle that I really want. Where can I use you, though? Got Klaus and, and Handy shooting down the length of this thing. So what do I do with you in the meantime? Maybe you can come out and, uh, and uh, you know, back up the ladies over here. I'm trying to lure everybody down here. Everybody pulls in, then we'll come up with the next run of something. Maybe even get somebody over here. There is a possibility. But I don't want to do it yet. I don't want to attract them to this point. So, draft. Your food is good enough. Come on out into this area as well. Okay, Miss Beep. You are up. You're fooded. You are mooted. And you're armed. And you were digging a compacted steel. Draft. <laughs> and you can probably get there as fast as anybody else. You're out in this area too. Since nobody can shoot at us, we can be out here really just based upon how fast they can run. So, Alicia. <clears throat> Food's horrible, rest is horrible. Hmm. I'm thinking about just giving you a meal and getting you right back to bed again. I have a feeling that food is going to be in starvation mode. You're already hungry. Yeah, I don't want that negative eight to chip away at you all night long so you start your day right over here. Let's grab a meal and then go back to bed. Eric, you were having mood problems and you kind of still are. I'm going to leave you alone. David, same thing. Yeah, leave you alone. Grandma is ready to fire a mortar cannon. Okay, so I guess wait for the countdown to get down to down to zero, and then aim. There's no way I can even pick a place right now. I'm guessing right here. 13, 10, boy. I think it's right here. So, set force target. Wait till it gets to one. Ah, you guys moved. <clears throat> Hold fire. Mad animal. <laughs> so hold fire. Mad animal, where are you? You're all the way up there and you... <laughs> Ooh, we have some deer. Oh, some deer came in. But <laughs> I remember one time we had a mad turtle and set it for hunt. And a day later it finally got into the base. <laughs> Okay, so back to Grandma. Where am I? Up in here. Turret. And you guys are getting into place. Sangri's getting there first. Okay, everything's looking... Oh, animals. Shouldn't be a problem for quite a while. Let's just assign them all to the animal safe zone anyway. Right where they already are. All the way to there. Grazing zone... Wild boars, okay. You guys will also be there. Let's scroll. You guys start the, the doe and everything else that's grazing and already in a safe place. Okay. That'll be fine. Nothing else has changed here. No sangrias. No red X's. Yep. Some right there that need to be done. Okay. That's all good. Now, one more time. Mortar. And I'm at 55 minutes. Don't know that we'll finish this battle, but let's at least... Oh, come on, guys. Turn down, turn down, turn down. Okay, well, then set target for... Right there. Mortar on fire because it's on hold, yep. Actually, set target for... There, and do that. And in case I have to do it again... Right there. Hopefully they all take that same path. Did it fire? There's another counter. Another. There it goes. Oh, don't hit the turret. Or the. Yeah. No, we're close. 
Yeah, that just doesn't work. Okay, so that was that was fun. Let's load the next shell. Actually, let's um, let's just do that. So you're beating out of your own our own fire. Oh, we've got we're lit that one. No, nope, not gonna worry about that. So, Grandma, what to do with you? Your mood is decent. Your food will last for a little while. You've got a revolver, and you've got a four shooting skill. Let's put you draft into this area. Okay, who's in place? Klaus is. Klaus, pop out. You guys, Sangria, out. Let's see who goes where. Tomislav, you're going there. Tomislav, pop into there. Rabbit, go right there. And they've all got shields. Okay, so Kirsten is going down first. Handy, you've got a sniper. You stay right where you're at. I don't think that's going to work. And yeah, this is going to take some more careful planning, especially in the dark. Kind of hard to see. So, you know what? I'm going to call it done right there. Next time we'll finish this off and then we'll do the cleanup. Sorry, folks, but catch you next time. Bye bye.